Welcome one more time experience. I just want to say hello to each one of you. Today we have something new. I'm going to show you now your classroom presentation to everybody. Please open your books. Everybody open your books. We have to see, uh, or we have to make a review about some uh, topics that you are learning previously, okay? Uh, you, you remember we were uh, we were working on the unit number four, so I'm gonna place here the unit number four, and we're gonna start um, making a very quick remember. Okay, um, there it is. For example, in this case, I'm gonna write, for example, to uh, my grandpa. No, I say, dear grandpa. Something like say, como querido abuelo, no? Dear grandpa, no? I play. You're gonna write here about the sport that you play, el deporte que juegas. For example, I play soccer. I can run, jump, and kick the ball, right? Those are the things that I can do in soccer, no? Las cosas que puedo hacer. I can run, jump, and kick the ball, no? In what sport? In soccer. And then it says, I don't play. This is going to be about a sport that, that I don't play. Un deporte que no juego. For example, could be, I don't play tennis, no? And finally, the question says, what about see you soon? And here I have to write my name. I don't know if it's my name, no? See you soon. And move out. Okay? But in your case, you have to complete with your own information. In your case, you have to complete with your information personal, okay? You have to do it with your personal information, yeah? Okay, we're going to start the game. Remember, the heads is one space and the tails are two spaces yeah we have to start from the beginning until the end the the girls are gonna be number one and then the boys i'm gonna flip it okay we are gonna start with uh, with the girls okay let's start with the girls so let me see mm -hmm. i'm gonna flip it i'm gonna flip it and uh, we have to decide how are we gonna go Okay, one moment, please. Oh, uh, yeah. That's it. One moment. One moment. And let's flip it, okay? Ready? This is for the girls. And girls, cross the fingers. You're going to be, the girls are going to be in this part. Yeah, las girls van a estar aquí. These are the girls. And then the boys. The boys are going to be in this way. These are the boys. Okay, ready? We are ready to start, huh? For the girls, flip it. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> girls, you have two spaces, the tails, okay? Girls, girls, this is gonna be for the girls. Let me see. Oh. From the start, one, two. Now, cualquiera de las girls me va a responder esto, ¿ok? Esto es para las girls. ¿sabes? Si las girls responden correctamente, se quedan ahí. Pero si las girls no responden, van a tener que regresar, ¿ok? So, girls, you have to tell me, does she have markers? What do you think? Yes, I do. Hmm? How do you yes, answer? Do. Does she have markers? Yes, she does. Or no, she doesn't. Yes, she no, doesn't. she doesn't. No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Mm -hmm. No, she doesn't, right? Because these are not markers. These are crayons. Yes, yes yeah? I... No, no, she doesn't. <clears throat> Sorry. Yes, no, she does doesn't. she have markers? No, she doesn't, right? These are crayons, crayons, no markers, okay? Very good story, very good story, okay? 
thanks to Soria, they're gonna stay on this part. Okay, now it's time for the boys. Are you ready, boys? Let's flip for the boys. Okay, boys, cross the fingers, boys, and let's flip it. Oh my God, what do we have here? Oh. Okay, very good. Boys, you are gonna go with number two. From the beginning part. One, two. Okay, boys, the question for you. Does she have markers? No, not she doesn't. Okay, pero boys, Sol Sol, boys. Es el turno de los boys, no las girls. Okay? ¿Quiénes están aquí ahora? Los boys. Okay, boys. Yeah. Does she have markers? No, she doesn't. Mm -hmm, very good. No, she doesn't, right? She doesn't have markers. Now, it's turn of the girls. Ahora vamos con las girls. It's your turn, girls. Let's say uh, congratulations to the girls. Yeah, the girls were lucky today. You know, mucha suerte, the girls, el día de hoy. Yeah, now let's go to the next part. Let's go to the next part. Um, I'm going to do something. This is page number 45. Let's go to page number 46. Teacher, you know, okay. más de ese tipo de juegos? Oh, más maybe. Okay, más adelante. Okay, now it's time to continue, students. It's time to continue. Let's go to the next page. Yeah, this is 46. Let's go to page number 47. Okay, I'm going to do this. What do we have here? Oh, we have something here. We have to work here. It says reading extra or extra reading one. Look at the photo and pair describe them. Okay, let's look at the photo. And you have to tell me here, students, what is it? Do you know? What is it? Huh? What do you think? It's a fish. Teacher, it's a fish. 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 It's Oh, uh, this, yeah, this is an interesting yes, 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 it's an insect. Okay, let's let's start from this. It's an insect. Now, look, what do we have to do? You have to listen, read, no, and you're gonna tell me what's an insect safari. ¿Qué será un insect safari? A science exercise? Un insecto. A gym class, what is an insect safari? You're gonna read. Yeah, you're gonna read. Vamos a leer. I'm gonna play the listening and we're gonna do this activity. Yeah, so pay attention. I'm gonna stop backing truck music and let's start now. Let's go on an insect safari. Today in Hong Kong, a class has a science lesson. But today's lesson isn't in the classroom. It's outside, in the park next to their school. The students have paper and pencils. Their teacher has a camera. They're on an insect safari. What's an insect safari? On an insect safari, you look for insects. You can find them in, on, and under plants and trees. You write about these insects and draw pictures. Here are some insects the students in Hong Kong find on their insect safari. Lantern flies. Look at the big photo. That's a lantern fly. It can fly and jump. Its body is blue, green, orange, yellow, white, black, 
and red. It has six legs and a long, colorful head. Dragonflies. Dragonflies have six legs too. They can fly. This dragonfly is called a blue dasher. Spiders. Spiders are arachnids, not insects. But this class finds spiders on their insect safari. Unlike many insects, most spiders can't fly. This spider is a golden orb weaver. Like all spiders, it has eight legs. Its legs are black, and its body is black and yellow. It's very big. It can eat a small bird. Oh, you have an interesting detail here, right? Now, please, you have to tell me, students, what is an insect safari? It's a science experience? It's a field trip? Or it's a gym class? Hmm? What do you think? Gym class, yes or no? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, gym class? No, no, no. No, oh, gym class. One, two, three, up, down, round. That's gym class. Not in that case, gym class. Okay, no gym class. Here we have two options, entonces. Podría ser a science exercise or a field trip. What do you think? Hmm? ¿Cuál será? An insect safari. A science exercise or a field trip? A field trip. Yes, that's a field trip, right? Very good. You have to circle the answer, okay? Circle the answer. It's a field trip. No, in this part says uh, the class is not in the classroom. Porque uh, este tipo de clase cuando van en un insect safari no es en el classroom. It's outside, fuera, in the park, next to the school, no? Los students van con su paper, su pencil. Es una salida de estudio, right? Now, what's an insect safari? You look for insects. Observas a los insects. Aquí no haces exercise, no haces gym, no haces gimnasio, no? You look for insects. You can find them under the plants, no? And you, ¿qué es lo que haces? You write, escribes, you write about this insect. You draw pictures, dibujas about the insects, okay? That's the insect safari. Number three, it says, read and munch. Lanternflies and dragonflies have eight legs, eat a bird, six legs, fly, jump and fly. What do you think? Lanternflies and dragonflies. Half, what do they have? What do you think? It's just half. Tienen what? What do they have? Hmm? Amos, you have to tell me the answer. Flea. Flea. Flea? Really? Hump and flea. Really? Are you sure? This is something in common. Que tienen ambos, ¿ah? Huh? Algo que tienen It's a bean. Mm -mm. What's something in common they have? Hay algo que tienen en común ellos. You don't know? Look, huh? it says, it says something here. Dragonflies have six legs too. Six legs. ¿Y qué dice aquí? Lanterfly, no? It has six legs. That's something in common. Ahí está lo que ambos tienen en común. What do they have? Six legs. Six legs you have here. I'm going to change this. Six legs. Now, let's see. Let's talk about spiders. What do we have? Spiders have what? Eight legs, eat a bird, jump and fly. What do you think? I have six legs. Six legs? Spiders? Así nos dice los spiders? Six legs? Six? Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Spiders? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué nos dice aquí de los spiders? Mm -hmm. 
Baby. Free and hump. Hump and flee. Really? Pero aquí te dice spiders have. Recuerda que cuando dice have, estás haciendo referencia a lo ¿Sí? que tienen. Have is tener. Spiders have. Ing. Ing. Tengo una araña. Ing land. Se pronuncia ink o se pronuncia eight. Eight. Ink, pues eight, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and this information you have here. You say spiders. Aquí nos dice, no, it has eight legs. Okay, so spiders have eight, eight legs. Yeah, let's do this now. Okay, let's continue. Number three. Spiders can't what? Eat a bird? Fly, jump and fly. What do you think? Jump and fly. Mm -hmm. Really? Add and wait. Really, really? Free, free. Fly. That's right. No spiders can fly. No pueden fly. What is fly? Volar, pues. Spiders can't fly, right? You have the answer here. Spiders can fly. Now, what about lantern flies? Lantern flies can something that the lantern flies can. What do you think? What's the answer? Hump and flee. Very good. It says on this part, no? Lantern flies, you have the answer. It can fly and jump flee. or jump and fly. Very good. Lantern flies, I'm going to do this. The okay. ultimo es profesor at a void. I'm oh, good. golden or waves can eat a bird, right? Yes, that's correct. And where do you have this information? No, you have this information on this. Professor, it's an insect I found. Small, a small bird. <laughs> yes, that's right. Okay, well, students, we are going to stop on this part. Esta semana no hay homework. Por favor, dedíquense a hacer su video, okay? Hacer su video, que ya les queda solamente una semana para su presentación. Okay, well, students, that's all for now. Thank you very much. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye. 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 Goodbye, teacher. Bye. Goodbye. Take care. Goodbye. Goodbye, teacher.